Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make tater tot hot dish. I had this a lot when I was a kid. I liked it a lot and uh, we make it for the kids and our family. And it's a easy, simple recipe. It doesn't take long. And here's the ingredients. You need a pound of hamburger, tater tots obviously, some uh, mixed vegetables, and if you prefer to use just green beans or corn, that's totally up to you. So anyway, about two cups of some sort of a vegetable can of mushroom cream soup and you're going to need a cup of shredded cheddar cheese some milk and uh, that's about it so first step preheat the oven to 350 and then we're going to go ahead and brown some hamburger so let's do it okay we're just going to go ahead and brown our hamburger up and we're just going to salt and pepper to your own taste so just brown this up and then we'll season it and then we're going to want to drain it too before we use So there it. we have it. Our hamburger is browned up. So we're going to drain this and then we're going to salt and pepper. And uh, then we're going to add the rest of the ingredients into this and we should be okay. good to go. We've got our hamburger browned, seasoned and drained. We've got this in a mixing bowl. So now we're going to add everything else except for the tater tots. So we're going to add two cups of vegetables. We're going to add the entire can of cream of mushroom soup. Okay, now we're going to add a half a cup, or I'm sorry, a whole cup of shredded cheddar cheese. right in. Next we need a half a cup of milk. I'm go ahead and add that right in. Then we're just going to go ahead and mix this all up. Okay, we got it good and mixed up. So we're going to Spray a casserole dish with a little Pam. Next we're going to dump this right in a casserole dish. Spread her out. Ooh. Looks good, don't it? Now we're going to take tater tots and we're just going to dump these frozen tater tots right on top so they're one deep. You don't want these more than one deep otherwise they won't cook real well. When these are done they'll be nice and Okay, we have our tater tots on top of our mixture. So we're going to go ahead and put this in the oven uncovered. Um, the oven is at 350 and it's going to cook for about 45 minutes and it will be done when it's nice and golden brown. So let's put this in the oven. Alright, after 45 minutes our tater tot hot dish is getting golden brown it smells awesome, so I'll put some on a plate so you can go ahead and see what it looks like. So there we go. You got your meat and your potatoes and your vegetables all in one dish, and kids like it. And uh, well, there you go. Enjoy. Thanks for watching.